So welcome Isaiah Vangana to uh, Wakefield Trinity. Finally arrived. How do you feel being around the place now? No, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm excited. It's, uh, it's good to finally be here. Um, long flight, long travel. Um, but yeah, it's good to come around the, the new uh, facilities and be shown around. And uh, feels good to be here. Already have the new jersey on. Uh, yeah, it feels good. Yeah, I'm guessing you're feeling a little bit jet lagged. Obviously, you've jumped off the plane and you're straight here, meeting a few of the coaching staff. How do how do you feel being coached by Daryl Powell? Have you heard much about him? Um, oh yeah, obviously, quite I'm probably looking a bit tired, a bit rugged. Eyes are red, I've been told. Um, but now I've uh, heard a lot of good things about uh, Daryl. Um, I know he, I guess he had quite a stellar playing career and has uh, done pretty well on the coaching side of things as well. Um, but I've been told from the new about the new coaching and the new staff. It's a whole whole new system, so it's exciting. Um, I'm excited to be a part of the new yeah the new system, the new team, and the whole uh, I guess rebuilding phase of things. Um, but yeah, it's uh, exciting times. Do you know any of the playing staff that you're going to be uh, playing alongside? Um, I don't know too many of the team personally. Um, just know of some of the boys, um, know some of the, I guess, the overseas players that have recently signed, like uh, Caleb, and I played against him in New South Wales Cup. Uh, Mason Lino actually reached out to me when I first signed, so it was nice to have, uh, yeah, have someone reach out to me and uh, offer a helping hand uh, if, if it was needed. The decision to sign for Wakefield then, I'm guessing you consulted your dad around about coming over to the UK, uh, what did he have to say about you joining Wakefield? Um, no, yeah, my dad, yeah, he was excited. He was excited for me. He's obviously um, been there, done there with, uh, I guess, playing with the league and having a stint over here with Bradford. Um, here, here, he was excited for for me knowing that it's a full-time opportunity, a, a chance for me to get out of my comfort zone and, uh, I guess, um, step out on my own. Um, show people what I can do and stuff. Um, but yeah, he, he gave my, me and my partner a bit of a reality check or a bit of a chat of the ups and downs of um, I guess the whole move over here and what life could be like. But overall, um, him and my mum were pretty pretty happy for me. Oh, nice, nice to hear. How excited are you then to get that playing shirt on for real in a game, probably in a couple of weeks' time when the jet lag's subsided? <laughs> No, yeah, excited as. Um, I mean, I got a bit lonely training by myself <laughs> um, back home. Um, as soon as I signed the contract, I was ready to come over. Um, just wanted to be back in that team environment, get around the boys. I know I'm a bit late to the, bit, bit late to the team, so I've got a lot of learning to do. Um, but yeah, just keen to get around it. Um, keen to put the jersey on as soon as I can, and as soon as I, I guess the coaching staff's happy with me. And, um, yeah, just keen to rip in really.